gentlemen, please welcome to the ring, Mike Cook. My name is Mike the Animal Cook. My fighting style is boxing slash submission fighting. And fighting Bobby Lashley, I know he was on TV as a wrestler. That's fine. He will shit his pants once he gets hit. And it's going to be very fast. It's going to be tap, tap, tap on his chin, and it's going to go straight to the ground, and he's going to be on his back. I'll be raising my hand. I will finish this fight in one of two ways. I will either make him tap out from punches, I will knock him out, or I'll, I'll throw a third one in for you guys, and I'll submit him. tonight is he mocking the former WWE wrestler Bobby Lashley I am sure that he's doing that you see there the, the from the seven wins three knockout three submissions you know I think the way to beat Bobby Lashley is go to the ground and submit him. You know, he will go to the ground but he's got to be submitted I don't think that you can stop his takeout so you got to work your submission game, and if you've got to go your submission game, you might beat him because he's still early in his career. That's going to be interesting to see if Mike the Animal Cook and his takedown defense can stop the wrestling background of Bobby Lashley. Mike Cook is the biggest underdog, according to Nick Kalikas, that on Fighting.com. He is a 6-1 to one underdog coming into this fight. But interestingly enough, he's already chalked up an MMA victory against a, another former WWE fighter, Daniel Puder. Wow. Could he make it two in a row? Yeah, well, he's, uh, you know, he had a warm-up one. Yeah, maybe uh, Cook, if he beats another former WWE fighter, maybe he should just go into the WWE, start taking on Batista and those guys. Hey, because, yeah, that's not a bad idea. No, maybe I should talk, maybe. we'll talk about it later. Yeah, yeah. I do want a 10% cut, though. Minimum. Minimum, thank you. Mike Cook trains with Frank Shamrock in San Jose, California. Tonight, the athlete, Jason McDonald, will be in his corner. Last fight, chalked up a win against Carter Williams by way of submission. That was back in March. The animal, Mike Cook, very confident coming into this fight. Up, jump up. And now back up to Brad Kelly. And welcome into the ring his opponent, Bobby Lashley. My name is Bobby Lashley. Fighting style is ground and pound. Well, I know he's going to brawl, so. I'm going to bring it to him the same way he's going to bring it to me. It's going to be a very intense fight. We're just going to battle, brawl, and, and someone's going to drop. Someone's going to stay down. In a perfect world, I'd like to stand up for a while. I'd like to trade shots with him because that's what he likes to do. Um, take him down, slam him a couple times, really wear him out, let him back up, and then drop him. This fight means everything for my career. Every fight that I have means a tremendous amount for my career. I have to keep moving forward. I have to keep winning, and i got to keep uh, moving up the ladder. Complete package, 33-year-old Bobby Lashley. 
I have never seen a fighter come into a bout as big of a favorite as Bobby Lashley is tonight. According to Nick Kalikas, he is over a 10 to 1 favorite. That wow. is unheard of in only his third professional fight. Unheard of. Yes, you said it right. And I was talking about it. I think the way to beat him is probably by way of submission because you know the fight's going to go to the ground. Then again, he's trading with the American top team. So he's got a good submission defense. The Sure he does. The Tale of the Tape, sponsored by the Girlfriend Experience, available now on demand before it's in theaters. Check it out. Lastly, with a bit of a weight advantage, when you look at this guy, he is a physical specimen. This guy is cut. Yeah, we talked about it now many times. Michael cannot come out on his feet, probably. Will go for submission on the ground. Can he submit it? We don't know. Trading with the American Top Team, I already mentioned it. You know, these guys are really good. You better believe that he trained really, really hard on a submission defense, but even maybe on submissions itself. Like uh, for him, the side mount, Americana. You know, a figure four. That is like a submission. Or, or, or Kimura, the reverse figure four. Those submissions are good for guys who are new in the game. And lastly, almost got caught in his last fight against Jason Guida in a guillotine choke. It looked like it could be over, and, and give Lashley credit. He, there's no way he was tapping out. He fought through it, and he said he learned a valuable lesson from that. Again, this is only his third professional fight. He does have the incredible wrestling background. Three-time national champion in wrestling. Of course, that was at Missouri Valley College and former WWE fighter. That's a whole lot of men right there. Well put, my friends. To the ring we go to Brad Kelly for the fighter introductions. Fight fans, this is the super fight of the evening. Make some noise! Three rounds in the MFC heavyweight division. Your referee is Big John McCarthy. Make sure your eyes are on him. Introducing first in the blue corner, he stands six feet, two inches tall, and weighed in at 234 pounds. With a record of seven wins and three losses. Fighting out of San Jose, California. The Anima And his opponent in the red corner, he stands six feet three inches tall, weighed in at 249 pounds, with a record of two wins and no losses. Fighting out of Denver, Colorado, Bobby the Dominator. All right, gentlemen, we went over the rules in the back and then we could get yourself at all times. I want you to fight clean, fight hard, fight fair. Do I have any questions from you, Mike? Any questions from you, Bobby? You want to touch gloves, touch them now? Let's get it on. No touching gloves from nope. Bobby Lashley. You know, and a lot of men, you know, all those muscles need oxygen. You go like, ah, maybe he doesn't have it. But for him training in Colorado, 6,000 feet high, you know, he's got the altitude advantage you here. You ready? We Get have up. the best in the business. Big John McCarthy gets us going. Bobby Lashley and Mike Cook in this heavyweight battle. And right away, he's going for a guillotine. Lashley like. going for a guillotine. We let it go. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Bobby Lashley coming out. That's it. That is all. Bobby Lashley chokes out Mike Cook. In about five seconds. Unbelievable. Whoa. Man, for a little bit, I, I, I thought he let it go. And then he re-gripped it again. My, yeah. You know, with the strength like he has. 